everyone i hope you're all well welcome back to my channel if you're new it's lovely to have you here my name is Gemma. um so today's video is a zara and topshop haul i can't believe i've actually never done a collective haul combined of the two because they're like two of my all-time favorite brands this week the weather has literally been so miserable like where has the sunshine been honestly i miss making iced coffees and being able to sit in the garden hopefully today's video will cheer you up as you can see there's lots of color and everything will be linked below as always including what i'm wearing today literally this is a full-on tie-dye look might not be for everybody i completely appreciate that but i saw it it's also from topshop and i have to pick it up so if this isn't in stock i will link something similar because i've seen loads online literally that's my favorite thing to do um, when i'm at home and i'm bored out of my brains i literally go on to every online retailer i hope you enjoyed today's video grab yourself a drink and yeah get cozy and let me know which is your favorite piece at the end first thing i picked up was this top i thought this one was a really kind of good in between top that you could wear with high-waisted jeans i think this is going to look amazing paired with light wash denim jeans but again you could mix and match it with shorts with skirts so it's just like long sleeves and then it has this bow detail at the front so it doesn't actually tie up that's just part of the kind of design but it's this really lovely like linen-y fabric and I picked this one up in a size 8 and it was £19 which I think is really really reasonable because actually quite chilly now and I feel like this will be a good piece to have when you can wear it on those cooler days when we go into summer so this did come in another colour I think it was lime I was really torn between which one to get but I thought this one is just a staple it's going to go with so many pieces and I can imagine this would look so cute paired with a basket bag as well next thing I picked up were these editor jeans I haven't actually tried this style before so I was really intrigued because I've literally been raving about the new Topshop premium mum jeans they are amazing but they're completely sold out I wanted to pick them up in another color so I saw these and I thought I might as well give them a go I haven't actually tried these ones on yet but I picked them up in a waist 26 leg 32 and I love this kind of like ecru off-white color I mean Topshop jeans are such good quality they're probably one of my favorites on the high street i really really like the feel of these they're a slightly more straight leg still high-waisted these ones were 49 pounds so i feel for top shot jeans they're a little bit on the pricier side especially as the top shot mum jeans i got recently i absolutely love them they were only 29 pounds to be honest the jeans will last you forever so yeah and i actually think they'd look really good with this tie-dye t-shirt so the next thing i picked up were these super cute gingham shorts i love these so again they feel like that kind of cottony linen material um and they've got this like stretchy paper bag waist as you can see like that and then they go down into this little frill detail they do have pockets i love pockets in shorts and skirts and everything so these also came in yellow and again i was so torn between the color but i think i'll get a lot more wear out of these ones and i also thought that this would be such a cute little outfit paired with sandals a trainer even like an espadrille wedge so these ones again i feel they were really reasonable yeah they were 22 pounds so for top shop little shorts again you could take these on holiday with you whenever that may be i think they're really really cute what i'll do as well is obviously i talk through the size in this video but what i've noticed is a lot of people when they leave comments they ask what size i'm wearing it in what i'll do from now on is leave the size i'm wearing next to the link so that might be a little bit more useful for you guys another thing i picked up were these pajamas i love topshop pajamas i think the quality is amazing i've got a pair that i actually got for a birthday present last year and i literally love them they wash really really well so i just thought these were so cute it would make working from home or being at home a little bit more bearable so you've got this long sleeve top in this like satin paisley print which is so so nice and then it comes with these little cute matching shorts so this does come as a set it was 32 pounds so a little bit more on the pricier side for pajamas but again like i said the quality is amazing 
they wash well, they last, so that's why I wanted to pick up these as opposed to maybe a cheaper pair. I literally love these. I've got these ones in a small, so I would say that's probably between an eight and a 10, but I find that Topshop pajamas come up a little bit on the bigger side, but I like that because I don't like my pajamas to be tight, but I thought they were really, really cute. I also saw they did after I ordered these, because I'm literally checking daily on the websites that they had a tiger print pair, which I'll link below and I'll insert a picture here. They just reminded me of Tiger King and Carol Baskin and I literally love them, but I think I'm gonna stick with these ones. I picked up this leopard print skirt, which I absolutely love. I think this is gonna look really nice with just a t-shirt tucked in, even like a slogan tee and trainers. You could dress this up with heels for a night out and like a bodysuit and even just dress it down, you know, with sandals. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bit on the thinner side i was expecting the material to be a little bit thicker but it's really really soft anyways and it goes down into this tiered style i did get this one in a size eight i probably could have sized down again but it's really comfy i love it but let me know what you think of this one and this one was 25 pounds so again really really reasonable animal print is such a classic print i love it it never goes out of fashion and i really like the kind of spot print on this one moving on to zara honestly zara have so many amazing pieces right now like i actually can't deal neither can my bank balance like honestly they're really kind of getting into their full-on spring summer collection and i absolutely love it so First up is this dress, which, oh my goodness, it's so gorgeous. So it's this floral print. It's these gorgeous like pinks and yellows and greens, and then it goes down like this. So it does look quite lot, well, no, it sits above my knee, just literally above. But um, yeah, I think this one is really lovely. It's again got these exaggerated sleeves, which are everywhere for spring and summer and then this really nice sweetheart neckline and i just love the colors the ruching makes it really really flattering so if you haven't been doing your home workouts don't worry this is going to be really really forgiving on your stomach and i got this one in a size small and it was well it says it was 29 euros but i think it was yeah, I think it was 29.99. Um, so let me know what you think of this one. I would definitely wear this as maybe more of like a dressier piece, probably with like a heeled sandal or a mule or an espadrille. Would look really cute with a little basket bag as well, but you could definitely dress this down. We've got a few bank holidays coming up in May, and if you're gonna be doing your like virtual Zoom barbecues outside with your family and friends, this could be a really cute one to add to your wardrobe. Next up is this top i wasn't actually sure when i saw this i'm like no i liked it but i the thing is i don't know how much of a fan i am of like off the shoulder tops anymore because what well, and dresses because they always spring up and it's just so irritating but i saw this and i loved it it's kind of like your classic table print um table print tablecloth design but i loved the colors so you've got lilacs and then like a darker lavender and since I've seen it in the flesh, I definitely prefer it way, way more. And I think this one actually would look really good with these kind of like off-white ecru jeans. This one was 19 99 which I think is really reasonable. Again, it will sit off the shoulder like that. It's quite a thin material. It does look like it actually might be a little bit see-through, but I think if you wear a nude or white strapless bra underneath there, you'll be absolutely fine but let me know what you think of this one guys in the comments oh my god i literally love this so this dress again from zara it's this baby blue polka dot print dress again it's got this really flattering ruching going down here so this was what i saw first and prompted me to make this order and i absolutely love it i just love this color for summer i think it looks so good with like everything you could definitely pair white accessories with this so i got this one in a size small it was 29.99 because i feel like zara dresses a lot of them what i noticed online were like 29 99 and under which is really good because a lot of them from past like seasons are like 60 or 80 pounds and i'm like that's quite a lot of money for a dress because let's face it zara isn't like the best quality i'm really really happy with this and 
yeah <laughs> let me know what you think of this one guys last piece i picked up this one again is going to be a little bit of a marmite piece for some people because of the pink but because of the pink because of the color so it's this like well fuchsia fuchsia pink it's very very bright but i love this neckline so it's a crop top and then it's got this like organza tie detail i don't i think on the model it was tied at the front so i'm gonna have to in the cutaway i'll style it how it is on the model but i just thought this one was really really cute again this will look amazing with white jeans like those ecru ones from top shop with your classic light wash denim jean i've actually got a pink oversized blazer from asos and it's a slightly lighter pink than this so i think the contrast of pink will look so nice together i got in a small and it was I think this one was 15 because it says it was 17 euros so i think this one was 15 pounds but all links will be below but let me know what you think of this one so guys that's the end of today's top shop and zara haul i really hope that you enjoyed it let me know your favorite pieces i just don't think i can pick <laughs> but um yeah like i said all links will be below and if you've made it to the end of the video comment with blue polka dot and we'll see who's made it so don't forget to like this video if you liked it subscribe if you are new and come back very soon because i'll be back with another video so thank you so much for watching guys see you soon bye